Have you ever wondered when and how slavery actually began? It's a difficult question with roots tracing back to the dawn of civilization itself. Picture the early cradle of civilization Mesopotamia. Here, around 5,000 years ago, the first known instances of slavery emerged, not as a racial or ethnic construct, but as a byproduct of war, debt, and crime. Then, think of ancient Greece, a blossoming hub of philosophy and democracy. Yet, at its core, it was a society built on the backs of slaves. They were integral to the economy, making up a significant part of the population. Fast forward to Rome, a civilization that took slavery to an unprecedented scale. Slaves were everywhere, from the households to the Grand Colosseum, shaping the very foundation of the Roman Empire. So slavery is as old as civilization itself, rooted in the fabric of ancient society. As we move into the Middle Ages the institution of slavery takes on a new form. During this time the practice of slavery began to shift and morph, becoming less about captured prisoners of war and more about the socio-economic status of individuals. This was the era of serfdom. Serfs were not slaves in the traditional sense, but they weren't exactly free individuals either. They were tied to the land they worked on and owed their labor to the landowner, often working long hours with little to no pay. This system, while different from traditional slavery, was a form of bondage that persisted for centuries. Simultaneously, another form of slavery was taking root in the Middle East and North Africa. Known as the Arab slave trade it was one of the longest yet least discussed slave trades. It spanned over a millennium, outlasting the Atlantic slave trade by centuries. The Arab slave trade saw millions of Africans and Europeans enslaved and transported to various regions of the Middle East. As the Middle Ages came to a close the world was on the brink of significant changes. The discovery of the New World, the Americas, by European explorers led to a massive shift in the global economy and subsequently, the institution of slavery. The Atlantic slave trade fueled by the demand for labor to exploit the resources of the New World, led to the brutal and systematic enslavement of millions of Africans. This was slavery on an unprecedented scale. It was characterized by its inhumanity, with slaves packed into ships under horrific conditions and its economic motive. It was all about exploiting human labor for economic gain, with little regard for the human cost. The discovery of the New World and the subsequent Atlantic slave trade marked a dark chapter in human history. It was a period marked by greed, dehumanization, and stark racial divisions that would have long-lasting effects that still resonate today. The discovery of the New World significantly expanded the scope of slavery, leading to a brutal and inhumane system. Now let's delve into the life of a slave. What was it like? Imagine a life filled with grueling work from dawn to dusk, under the constant watch of overseers. The toil was relentless, often under the scorching sun or in the freezing cold. Slaves labored in fields, mines, and households, their hands bearing the brunt of back-breaking tasks. Their bodies were commodities used and abused at the will of their masters. Their living conditions were deplorable. Cramped quarters, poor sanitation, and inadequate nutrition were the norms. Illness was rampant, and medical care was a luxury they could seldom afford. Their lives were fraught with the constant threat of punishment, often brutal and inhumane. The whip and the iron collar were symbols of their captivity. Yet in the midst of such despair the enslaved people found ways to resist. They subtly sabotaged work, feigned illness and sometimes risked everything to escape. They maintained their cultural practices, crafting a unique blend of traditions that offered solace and community. Their songs, stories and dances became acts of defiance, expressions of a spirit that refused to be broken. They resisted not just physically but also psychologically. Holding on to their humanity, they nurtured dreams of freedom, pushing back against the narrative of their supposed inferiority. Their resilience was their rebellion, their hope a silent protest. Despite the unbearable conditions enslaved people resisted in various ways demonstrating their indomitable spirit and longing for freedom. Slavery is a dark chapter in human history, a system that has left deep scars on our world. We've traced its origins, learned how it evolved through the Middle Ages and into modern times, and glimpsed the harsh realities of slave life. This journey through time, though brief, offers a sobering look at a painful aspect of our past. We hope this brief journey through time has given you a deeper understanding of this complex and painful part of our past. If you found this video informative, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and leave your thoughts in the comments below.